Parents of an Otay Ranch teen will hold a silent protest after a video shows a group of teens beating their son inside a restaurant. It's a miracle for me that he didn't get killed. 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala is live in Chula Vista. Now, Mimi, it appears the restaurant has shut its doors after this incident. Yeah, Virginia, Jim, when we got here to the restaurant on East Palomar Street this morning, the sign was actually posted outside on the door saying that they are temporarily closed due to the current events. But the teen's family will be here tonight holding a silent protest to send the community a clear message about bullying. Eight people throwing chairs, stomping on his head and, and robbing him. That's a mob. Margarito Martin's 16-year-old son was assaulted inside of Cotixan Mexican restaurant last Thursday as he waited for his mom to pick him up after school. Martin says as the teenagers were jumping his son, everyone inside the restaurant just stood back and watched, even recorded video on their cell phones, but no one stood up and helped. That's why he and his family will be holding a silent and peaceful protest to stand up against bullying at 5.30 this evening. Martin says when he and his wife filed a police report, the response from the officer didn't really sit well with them because it appeared that the teens responsible wouldn't really be held accountable for their actions. He told me that because they're minors, they were just going to get a slap on the wrist and community service and uh, to be sincere, there, nothing was going to happen. And again, that silent protest will be held outside of Cotixan Mexican restaurant at 530 tonight. We're also expecting an update on the investigation from the Chula Vista Police Department. We're live in Chula Vista. Mimi Alcala, 10 News.